We're learning uh, that the president has been frustrated with his border czar. We're talking about Vice President Kamala Harris. An upcoming book about the president's White House victory reportedly claims he called Harris a, quote, work in progress. The book also claims she was unhappy about being assigned to the border in the first place. Joe Khalil details the alleged tensions in the White House. Joe. Hey, Adrian, good morning. So this is a bit of a palace intrigue type thing here. Chris Whipple is an author and journalist working on a book, and in it he talks about just the first couple of days and weeks of the brand new administration back in 2021 in the early stages. And what he describes is a bit of frustration between President Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris, citing at one point uh, an anonymous one source that he says is a friend of President Biden, and he quoted him as saying that the president called Harris, quote, uh, a work in progress. Now, that wasn't the only example that he detailed in this new upcoming book. He also talked about uh, a bit more frustration because Vice President Harris's husband, Doug Emhoff, was apparently venting about some issues that Harris was given to take charge of. Emhoff reportedly didn't think they were serving Harris well politically. And in this book, uh, he describes President Biden as being a bit annoyed by that. Harris was tasked, among other things, as you mentioned, with the border and with voting rights to major policy areas. Now, it's not the first time that we've seen reporting about tension in the vice president's office. You may remember back in 2021, a series of stories that were published in the New York Times and in Politico and other places that sort of painted a chaotic picture of the vice president's office as a number of staff members were leaving their jobs and uh, taking other jobs. Some of those stories, however, White House staff publicly denied at the time, uh, even mocked sometimes on social media. Now, we did reach out to the vice president's office. So far, no response from them on what is in Chris Whipple's new book. Adrian. All right, Joe, thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.